And this morning, our newest meteorologist, Matt Standridge, is helping you find some fun things to do with the family. It's part of a new series called Go Ohio. And this week, Matt shows you one last place to see the fall leaves before they're gone. Hi, I'm meteorologist Matt Standridge. Every week we're going to be exploring some of the best places to see and things to do right here in Ohio. This week we're covering the covered bridges of Ashtabula County. Let's go Ohio. Thick woods along the shores of Lake Erie create a beautiful landscape. But if you look closely in between the colorful fall leaves, you'll find covered bridges, 19 of them in fact, 17 of which are still in use today. Why are there so many covered bridges in Northeast Ohio? Well, we spoke with the director of the Ashtabula County Covered Bridge Festival to find out. Originally, they say there could have been over 50 of them in this county. Back then, wood was plentiful and an easy way to build, and they built them covered because covering them helped protect the timbers and they last a lot longer. Nine of our bridges were originally built in the 1800s, over a century ago. There are many covered bridges still standing throughout the Great Lakes and Northeast, but visitors go out of their way to see ours. Why? Ours, all 19 of them are different. They all have their own unique look. You know, they're not all painted white on the ends with red sides. We've got all different colors. Our neighboring states have a lot too, but they all look the same. They're all were built by the same builders. They pretty much all kind of look alike. Here's a fun fact. We have the nation's longest covered bridge, the Smolin Gulf Bridge. It spans 613 feet over the Ashtabula River. It was built in 2008. And then just 10 miles away as the crow flies, we have the nation's shortest covered bridge, the Liberty Street Bridge. That one's spanning only 18 feet. While these two bridges are newer, there are so many old bridges to visit, taking you back in time to an 1800s Ohio, right here in Ashtabula County. Crossing the covered bridges where you live, I'm 3 News meteorologist, Matt Standridge. That's so cool, things I didn't know. Well, there are two main tours that you can drive to see all 19 bridges provided by the Ashtabula County Covered Bridge Festival. We have those directions and a complete list of all of the bridges on our website, WKYC.com. Holly, it's probably one of those weekends where yeah. the leaves are going to be popping. Oh. It'd be nice to like get in the car, turn on the heat a little right. bit. Right. And maybe just go check drive. out that fall color. I don't want it to go away. It's such a lovely, it's just so pretty. stunning time of year here. Yeah.